Why did you want to speak? That's a good one. Um, sorry if I'm in the middle of the plane. Um, you know, like, um, now, I did move to the other, as you guys can tell. So, just by tapping, but nothing major. Um, I, as you guys can see, I'm moving around a little bit. Um, so yeah, um, it used to be, um, the TV's me, um, that off moved it, um, to in front of my window, so, but, um, my little smoke, um, it's not in the weed, it's just rise, um, but my friend, he cleans out his bowl, um, once a week, um, and that, and gives us the red, me and my girl the red, because we like reds, you know, hey, it gets us through, you know, so, we can get weed, we help. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Cheers. dry out red, um, that it won't, like, for, for example, um, like, there's that paper towel trick, but the rest I get is so sticky that it sticks to the, um, paper towel, um, so yeah, anyone can basically tell me in the comments on how to um, dry out red, I feel like we appreciate it. Um, cause yeah, I would love to know how to dry out the red, cause the red I get is so sticky. Um, so yeah, just leave in the comments below and let me know how to dry out the red. And also, um, this is going to be a two-part video. Um, this is going to be smoking, and also I'm going to be doing um, a review of um, Jara Couple Limits Edition. So yeah, um, this was the first part. Um, stay tuned for the next part. See you in the video. This is, um, Manjaro, um, Linux edition. Um, now, I know this hasn't been updated in quite some time, but I just want to give my review about it. Um, as you can see, Spatula's customized the boot screen, basically. You can start M calls, start the non for drivers, boot for hard disk, hardware detection tool, memory test. Um, as you can see, he's got the couple of Linux Manjaro edition. I really like how he was able to customize the boot menu and stuff. Um, so yeah, let's just start and call. Um, now this is based off of version 16.04, um, Manjaro, um, dish, Manjaro. Um, as you can see, also we've got boot animation right here. Not the typical Manjaro, you know, with the dots. But he's got the low, a low mark going around his Linux signature mark. Um, I really like that. It gives a unique feature. Um, 
and so yeah, we boot up, you know, you're expecting something great. Other, you know, especially he's a great um, he designed this great. He did have help in it, I think. Um, people helped him through the process, but yeah. Um, again, um, once the, once we get into it, I'll show you guys. You can see he's also customized the um. The welcome screen. Um, he's got it says M Cole, which it is. Um, thank you for choosing the Madonna Cup Linux edition. Um, he's really been able to customize the welcome screen, which I think is really unique. Not a lot of people do that in their respawns. So yeah, that's a little cool. I'm on the documentation and get readme, which I highly I highly recommend people read this if they're not familiar with Jaro or they want to um, get some um, help on IRC. I highly, highly recommend um, the, the Rini. It will help people who are not familiar with Mandara. Um, and the release info basically telling you about 15 at 12. Um, you know, stuff like that, it'll tell you more about it. Um, then you, do. you can go to the chat rooms, you can sign up for the mailing lists. Um, you've got three ways to install this, but for new users, I recommend these two right here. I highly recommend those two for new users. Um, so yeah. Anyway, um, on the panel, you got, you know, your basic log out, restart, shut down, spend, hibernate, you know, stuff like that to get to for the system. Um, then you got so simple usage analyzer. Analyzer tells you, you know, how your computer's running, the CPU uses, all that good use. Um, then you got simple time with the calendar. Um, the XFCP calendar that this is based off of. Um, then you got, um, this is a weather forecast. Basically, what it is, is that this will, it will, um, let you know about weather maybe. So, you know, how, just to use the code, um, go to Right click, go properties, go to change, put the zip code. Okay. It'll, it takes a while for it to uh, back. Um, it goes faster if you install it. Um, this is Pamic, my Maplet. Network connectivity, no matter if you're on wire or wireless. Um, you got compares, use an icon, which lets you change compares right on the fly. Um, so that's really cool. Then you have, um, a quick access to pulse on your body control. You know, to control your input, your output, recording, your playback, your configurations, all that good stuff. Um, then you got, um, just a simple music, music player, it's one that they include in the channel, um, that one, I, I'm not, I'm not familiar how to pronounce the name, but it's right there, um, so yeah, I've not, I've not played around with this music player, um, I'm more of a DLC type of person, but yeah, that. For you. Um, then you got, um, play on like, then you got play on like, what play on like is, 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 it's a simple tool that let you basically run Windows games or any Windows application inside Linux. Um, it's basically like a virtual environment. Windows application. Um, I'm going to one day do a solo review on Play on Linux. So I'm going to install the entire virtual machine 
20 um, on 20 on the link. See what it can do. So definitely um definitely subscribe for that. Um I'm gonna be doing reviews of certain programs I find on Linux. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Um but anyway you got mouse pad which is just a simple simple text other than nothing fancy. Um nothing fancy nothing fancy you know it's just a simple text editor um you know you can say documents all that movies um then you got chromium which he's opt out from firefox you got chromium which i think is really cool i really like chromium in my opinion um which is basically the open source version of chrome um and what it What's unique about this is that he's got his own customized search, which is just a simple Google search that's customized. Um, then you got quick access to Mujaro, the Linux site. You dispatch his YouTube channel, dispatch his G Plus, and quick, quick search at his Steam, um, Mujaro site, and Mujaro Wiki, the Out Wiki, and this unique tool is called Trouble Search. So basically, let's say you know, I have a problem with HDMI disk, like, okay, you search it. Basically, what it does is it pulls everything from the art wiki, the Mazar wiki, anything related to your problem, it will pull. Um, pull for it. So I think that's really cool. Um, I really like that um, feature. Then you got um, just you know your basic do not. Then you have a quick access to um your terminal. This is XFC drop down terminal. Um, and as you can see, spatches include a little button, and he's also included the screen fetch. Um, so we can keep an eye on like our OS, our kernel, our shell, our resolution, our desktop environment, our window manager, GTK theme, icon theme, the font, the CPU, GPU, and RAM. So yeah, that's really cool. Um, and but anyway, um, you got, you know, you you got the little peg one, which I think, I think I really like the peg one, because it's unique, it's Spatchy, you know, Spatchy is a cool guy, he, I don't know, every video he uploads, um, he's just, if it wasn't for Spatchy, I wouldn't have learned about the job, so I said, him and Matthew Moore really taught me about art and the job. so yeah. Um, and then you got the risky menu here, which you know you got your basic XFC stuff, accessibility, you know, all that good. He's added Bleach Bit, which what Bleach Bit is, it's basically an application that is like CC cleaner for Windows. Um, so yeah, you can clean out your history all that good. Um, Add it, like I said, bleach bit, um, chromium, compass, um, fusion icon, and compass setting manager, um, hatch chat is still in here, you get the fully box of speed, um, mumble static so you can, if you need any help, or you need to the mumble chat room, um, but yeah, you got Play on Linux, um, Steam, he's got VLC in this one, um, which I don't like VLC, so yeah, that's cool. Um, also he's added some background to him, um, so yeah, let's go back here. Um, he's added... But he's added this, 
Penguin looking at the window of the butterfly. Just let the leather look in one. Um, this one's really cool. It's like a space theme. Um, the le a different leather one with um, the penguin. Um, and that one, that's totally off scale, but then again, zoom to the center and make stuff like that of mine. Uh, it'll be different for yours. Uh, so yeah, um, every monitor is different. So yeah, don't pick zoom that. Like, it's gonna have to be everything. All monitors are different. But yeah, um, anyway, this was just a review of M4 by Smash. Um, I really liked it. To, um, I think he actually asked people to come with the one. So yeah, this is kind of a group effort. Um, and I really like that. Um, so yeah. Um, again, like I said, um, definitely like, comment, and definitely subscribe for more videos. Cause like I said, I'm gonna do a review on Play on Linux. Um this application right here and we will see what applications can run inside Linux and what applications really can. So yeah, um, again this is the third topic and I will talk to you guys in my next Y'all take care. Hey.